outspoken Albany investor is opening up about why he believes an arsonist started the fire that destroyed his historic home on Monroe Street. Thank you so much for joining us. Fire investigators have not confirmed Will Gears claims about arson, nor have they ruled it out. But the question we're asking is why someone would want to burn down a historic home that's being remodeled. Gear admitted to WAOB News 10's Quinlan Parker his own words may have been the fuel for revenge. I believe it is somebody that didn't like that I called him out, whether it was this guy over here that is going to federal prison or the other dope heads that I've called out. They're the ones that didn't like it. And, and, it, and the stupidity of the whole thing is that this economically doesn't hurt me. This actually, with my insurance, will put money in my pocket. But in an indirect way, the fire that destroyed his home hurts Albany. A piece of property that would have added charm and value to a nice neighborhood is now blighted. Everybody enjoys the historic district and they continue want to want to develop downtown Albany. It's not to say that you can't come with a brand new building down here or something. But this is a piece of history, and this is one of the things that kind of is an attraction to most towns when you go into. Gear says he doesn't believe he has enemies, but if you look at his Facebook page, he clearly has his share of critics. He often uses colorful language, and sometimes it's personal. Will you continue to invest in Albany if you feel people are out to get you? I'm about to acquire probably another nine lots down here. They don't, I don't have any fear. I will be able to turn around and build probably six, seven, eight units right here, which will be much more economically feasible than spending hundreds of thousands of dollars on a historic house. And we're still waiting to hear back from the Albany Fire Department for an incident report. Once we get that, we'll share it on air and online. Quilla Parker, WAOB, your hometown news source.